Modafinil is a very interesting compound in the fact that it is sort of a non-stimulant stimulant. So they call it like a wakeful agent. So it's basically, it's affecting some of the dopaminergic and attention portion centers of the brain. It also sort of messes with the sleep portion in the evening, which is somewhat of a trade-off that most people take. But because it's not like a direct stimulant in terms of how it affects the sympathetic nervous system as strongly, people will shift modafinil over, say, Adderall. The problem is, is that whenever you take a substance or a compound like a wakeful agent, is it blocks the sensory feedback mechanisms of the rest of your body and it's overriding all of those factors. And so you don't really know where your baseline is at all in terms of like how hard you're pushing mentally, physically, and then even the feedback systems emotionally. And so that's why any type of compound, particularly it can be modafinil, I wouldn't consider it the worst compound on the market, but along with other stimulants, it prevents us from actually knowing where the state of our body actually is. So when you pull off of it, if your acetylcholine has changed, your dopaminergic side has changed. Any of the feedback mechanisms of going too hard for too long, you're going to be in a depleted state. And so this really messes with someone's capacity to be in their body. Because flow state is sort of like on the hinge of like, you're creating a fundamental like neurochemical, physical representation of that, but in a way that's dissociated from the body. And true flow state actually ingrains both of them, the body and the mind. You're fully in your body and you're actually outside of the default mode network. And so when people say like, I've lost myself in the moment, but with most drugs, they're edging on dissociation, meaning dissociation of being in your head in your mind because of the chemical overflow, but losing your body in conjunction. And that's why a lot of them lead to burnout is because like you're not able to stay present in your body because those feedback mechanisms have been blunted because of the overriding nature of how modafinil works in the brain. And again, there's much worse agents out there, but anytime you mess with some of these things, you're overriding the feedback mechanism and being in the body is a big part of the flow state because you don't want to be in a dissociative state because then you don't know actually how you feel. If you found this video to be of value, be sure to like it, subscribe to our channel if you wanna see more videos, leave a comment if you have a question, if you've got something to say. Camelback Recovery provides treatment services for people struggling with mental health, mental illness, addiction, alcoholism. So if you or someone you know is struggling, be sure to reach out to us. You can go to our website, camelbackrecovery.com or our information is in the comments section below. And we provide everything from detox, inpatient, outpatient treatment, sober living, recovery coaching, sober companion services. So either we'll be able to help you or we'll be able to refer you to people or treatment centers that might be a better fit. So I will see you in the next video.